sitting in the front beside me. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Get in. You read my diary. You lied to me. You can't control me. I'm going to see Jeff behind your back. Not this weekend, you're not, kid. I see this place still moves at its usual rapid pace. Unleaded things. Just remember one thing, Yvonne. You're a reflection of me. It's never just yourself you make a fool of when you do something wrong. I just don't think I could be more disappointed in you. I trusted you. I trusted you. When I think of what you planned to do in our family house... Nothing was gonna happen. I just love how ordinarily you wouldn't be caught dead wearing gel and junk. But just because you want to impress Auntie Rhea and Trish how with it you are, you go out and you buy that bizarre jumpsuit. That's exactly the kind of talk I don't want. So just because you read something you had no business reading, I have to miss the biggest after-game party of the year, miss having the house to myself, and get dragged yourself, away from civilization to go through some dead person's stuff all weekend. That dead person happens to be my mother. Stare the guy down much, Mum? Could have married his father. Yvonne, get in the front. No. Get out of this car and wave. Is this a thrill for them or what? Here comes Rhea to tell us to go around the back. Go round the back! Oh, you always look so jazzy. 
If I had known you were bringing Yvonne, I'd have thought to brought Jill. Not that she'd come without a leash. It's like Elaine walking through that door when she was that age. Is traffic, Babbitt? Bumper to bumper. What'd you do to your hair, Elaine? You forget to comb it's it out. Made, it's supposed girls. to look like that. It's the style. Gel. Looks greasy. What you gonna have to drink? Oh, she's okay. I'll have tea. She'll have oh, tea. Sure. It's a bottle of ginger ale. Yeah, I made a tin salmon sandwich for lunch. It's been repeating on me ever since. Lloyd brought Rhea in from the farm about four. We've hardly scratched the surface so far as things go here. I never go anywhere without my ginger ale. Yvonne doesn't want ginger ale, Rhea. She's grown up on us. She wants tea. Now, don't break it, Yvonne. Okay, I won't have tea. No, have it. She's okay, Elaine. Has she got a boyfriend? But she goes with a nice boy. I'm not steady yet, I hope. We are. Once you're married, you'll be tied down for life. You don't want to be tied down at your age. This steady business just creates a mess. Guess which one of your crowd already has a grandchild? At Joyce Saunders, used to be Joyce Melnick. I was never really friends with Joyce Melnick. She more or less was just there. How's Eddie Lane? Oh, he's fine. A young couple bought this house. She works for the IGA. Is that right? Meat department. It's going to be hard at first. Oh, it will. Oh, sorting through Mum's things here, Trish means. Trish, that what you meant? Yes. I'm getting used to a young couple living here. What all? I'm glad the house took eight months to sell. I couldn't have tackled it right after. So, this boy got a name? Jeff, you haven't seen the stone, Elaine. They're all called Jeff. What stone? No. Gravestone. What do you think? Gall? Oh, oh gravestone, right. <laughs> How big's his head? Oh, Rhea. Enormous. <laughs> no, it is not. She's just kidding, dear. It's the first thing a girl should take note of. Go for the ones with a small head. Trust me, you'll be glad you did once you get in that delivery room. She's going room. steady, Rhea, not having birth. The cart follows the horse. I had 43 stitches with Stevie, 51 Enough, with Jill. Rhea. Where? Used to sit and listen to Mum and her friends around this very table. Do you remember old lady Lutz? Well, soon as you see the baby, you forget all about the pain. No, she's gone now, do, dear soul. Dear soul, my eye. She had a cruel streak a mile long. Sweetie, listen to your Annie Rhea. You don't forget the pain. All my friends are probably just a given her right now at that party. And where's Yvonne? Stuck out in the sticks hearing about people's stitches. <sighs> Real fun. Great weekend this is turning out to be. Are you going to tell Dad about what you read in my diary? I don't know.